One of the blogs I read regularly is the PowerPoint Ninja. It's just PowerPointNinja.com. And today he had a post, how to create a sexy curved arrow in PowerPoint. So something like this. And in the post, he explains the steps how to do it. So I thought I would create a screener and show you how to do it. So it's just a matter of creating the arrow and then converting it to a free form and then editing the points to create that. So let's take a look at how I did it. So this is one I made already. Make a, a new slide here. I'm just going to remove that stuff. I need an arrow. There's one. Okay, so there's an arrow. I'm just going to rotate it down a little bit. I still have it selected. Going up to drawing tools. I'm going to click on that, convert to free form. There's a two-step process here. Now I've got to edit points. So you can see how those points on the arrow have changed. So let's just start, uh, you know, so I can sort of stretch this thing out a little bit. So stretch it there. And these side handles, that's how I'm adding the curve here. So I'm just playing around with this a little bit. Getting a curve. I guess it'd be a stretch to say that what I'm doing is sexy, but it's uh, the technique shown. So I think it's kind of an interesting way to, if you can't find just the shape you want uh, from what's available from the the standard shapes, to make one. So that's uh, so that's what I've managed to do here. Um, let's avoid any commentary uh, about how that turned out. And let's go back and I'll tell you again that this is uh, directions from a blog I read that's called the PowerPointNinja.com. This has been Greg Fries from, among other places, EPS411.com and EverydayEMSTips.com. Thanks PowerPoint Ninja for the tip.